So a lot of you have been asking, how did I do my nails on video? Not these nails right now, but I usually kind of wear a lot of nudes and I do a lot of opal looks or kind of a little smoky look. So I'm gonna kind of show you the technique, but I'm gonna make it kind of like a fall vibe. So let's get started. As you can see, I built out my extension already and I'm doing it all in gel. So the first thing I'm going to do is give it kind of like a little gold feel. I don't wanna overpower it, so I'm just gonna get a few pieces. So this is sticky. I have not wiped off the sticky layer. You, all, you need to keep it sticky the whole way through. So what I'm going to do is pick up some pieces and kind of just use my imagination of where I want to place them. And I'm going to do two nails at once. This is literally what I would do in salon. And you don't want to place them in the same spots. You kind of want to randomly place them. All right, that looks kind of cool. I'm going to kind of melt it in with my finger. And I'm going to flash set this for 30 seconds. My next step is I'm going to take my base gel and go over the top of the nail. The reason why I put the nail under the light for 30 seconds is I needed it to hold on to my foil so I could polish right over it with my gel. So the colors I'm going to be using in my base gel that's not cured is Rockstar and Crush Pearls, of course, and one of our new colors that are in, it's Insider Voice. It's a really cool micro, kind of obsessed with it right now. So what I'm gonna do is just use my imagination in different spots. And it is wet, so make sure every time you touch the nail and go back for more, you're not continually going on because you'll cake up your brush. So what I'm doing is I'm creating a background. I'm gonna go into my crushed pearls. And the crushed pearls are kind of giving it a fall vibe as well, going into winter, or just a nude, a nice nude design. Okay, now I'm going to go into Rockstar. Rockstar is gonna give it like a pink green kind of look. On dark colors, it turns really green. So what I'm going to do is go under the light for 30 seconds. What I'm going to do from here is dust off my sides. Now I'm going to bring out Chunky Chunk. So what I'm going to do is layer again. I bring out my base gel and I bring it over the whole entire nail. This is also going to give a really cool glass effect. Okay, so now let's pick up some colors. Now you just use your imagination. There's really no wrong or right place to set them. I think I'm gonna use a little more gold as well, just a tad bit. I like to layer as I go. I make up my mind as I go just by the look. This has been one of my number one requests and I've done it many different ways, but I'm using the same technique. So you could get creative with this yourself. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is make like a cloudy, milky white. I'm gonna use gloss and I'll make enough for this length as if you're doing four to five of them. Because usually they want just a few. If they want them all, you're going to make pink. So get a little white, a little bit at a time. Make it as milky as you would like. So I'm just gonna create some cloudy dimensional effects. And there's no wrong or right way to do this. You really just use your imagination. And in some spots, like I like to go over my big chunks of mylar, then that way that kind of, kind of has a cloudy bling through it. Okay, so from there what I'm gonna do is wipe my brush. I'll get my micro detailer. And I just wanna create some depth. So I'll go into my white and kind of shake my hand just a little, like wiggle it. And you can see this mylar sticking up. It's gonna look amazing like that. It does not need to lay all the way down. Now remember, you can make it as milky as you like. Once you learn the technique, you could get really creative with this whole look. I've done it with dark colors, so get really creative with it. Okay, so once you're out, if you would like to add a little more gold to give it a little more of a winter or fall effect, let's detail it with a little bit of glitter. The same colors I've been using, just kind of trail it and highlight it. You're purely using your imagination from here. So what I'm going to do from here is cure it one more time for 30 seconds and I'm going to encapsulate it. Okay, from here I'm going to use Build Pink and I'm going to use our tube. I circle it one direction with no pressure, just on top of the nail. Then I'm going to squeeze straight down the middle You'll start to see your design come to life. I like to use my brush when I use my tube as well because it gets it high enough and then my sides I'm able to detail what I'm doing. 
So now I'm gonna put this under the light for 30 seconds. Try to get it everywhere you need to, but honestly, with nails this long with gel, you'll come in with one more application if needed. Put the light over her for 30 seconds. When I look at it from the side, I need to make sure I have enough arch. I need some right here, and I need some right here. As you can see, it's already melting into it. All I'm going to do is guide it to where I need it, and then I'm going to final cure her for one minute. From here, I'm gonna file them into shape and come back with the finished look. So I hope you enjoy the final look. Just remember you could use like opal colors. You can make it more wintry with silver. Use your imagination and have fun with it. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel now. Subscribe to the channel.